you know, this is a, kind of a dream come true for me to be hosting the show. It's a really amazing thing. There's nothing quite like the process here. I'll just dance around like this a little bit. Just a little bit, moving around just a little bit like that for luck. That's just a thing that I do. Understand I'm a real astronaut. We're not just playing dress up, up Don't there. be a shade, Ronald. He's great. He's so nice. He just came in yesterday. He's rolled in, though, in a really, really calm and cool fashion, which is really great. He's, you know, he's in the same sort of peer group with most of us and can just sort of joke around and riff with us and have fun. I think he's used to working in an ensemble show, so it's right. not, you know, as big a transition as it might otherwise seem. I was just excited as kind of like a fan, and I'm going to get to see the stage and all that stuff, and it's today that I'm realizing, wait a minute, I have to, like, be on the show as well. A lot different than what you're used to at Friends? No, it's the same. <laughs> Haven't you been paying attention? <laughs> uh, no, it's very different. Very, very different. It's, uh, but you know, it's similar in that it's just a bunch of funny people trying to crack each other up all week long, and that's like my favorite place to be. So. You step right in, huh? Step right in here, man. You're operating on partly on fascination, partly on fear. I would, I would oh think. yeah, there's a lot of fear. There's a lot of fear. It doesn't hit like you that it's that it's a live show. And, I mean, it hit me that it's a live show, like, yesterday, and I agreed to do it months ago. I was like, yeah, we'll do that thing. <laughs> and then they're showing you, well, this is where we're going to drag you to change your clothes. I'm like, I can, I can do it myself. He's like, no, 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 you have 20 seconds, and then you have to be out there. And, you know, I'm admitting that I'm a moron on your show, but you don't really think about it until you're here. What's it been like? Well, apparently, these guys work day and night, obviously. Yeah. Now, I'm told that you're right there in the trenches with them. Yeah, yeah. I... I I really want the show to be, you know, good, and I want to, uh, and I think that I should be in charge of that now. I, you know, I just, uh, I wanted to be around. You know, this is a, kind of a dream come true for me to be hosting the show. So, you know, I'm not going to be like, okay, you guys, uh, do everything you can. I'll be, you know, having dinner somewhere. I can do that anytime. He came prepared. He came with sketches, with ideas that he wants to do, comedy ideas he wanted to play, and try some different notes than he does on Friends, that kind of thing. So Matthew Carey is great. He's um, he's so funny. He's gonna do. He does a great Woody Allen impression. So he's gonna do that in a sketch that I worked on. He's doing a Michael Keaton on a Jeopardy sketch, and uh, yeah, so he should be really funny. I think he's got a um, a couple up his sleeve. He's got a Michael Keaton that's really strong, and a uh, Julio Iglesias. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Who, who's still out there in the running? Now. I'm told also that you do several impressions. Well, I'm not going to do them here for you now because no. you know got to save it for the show. But yeah, I do a couple of I do a couple of impressions. Was that a little scary for you to try try it out in front of these guys? I mean, uh, or is that something you do constantly around the set and friends? And yeah, it was scary because you you know, like the guy from Friends coming and saying, "Hey, yeah, I do impressions, and these are the people who do them the best." <laughs> yeah, that was a little scary. But you know, what the hell? You give it a shot. Well, I heard there's a Woody Allen. I heard there's a Michael Keaton. There is. Uh, there's a Michael else? Keaton. Uh, there's a. Uh, I'll be doing a little Julio Iglesias for you. You know. <laughs> sure. It's topical. <laughs> they try to do the show like it was right now, like the hippest thing, and I right. said, "Well, Julio Iglesias," and they said, "Great." So yeah, I'll be doing him. You think I'm kidding, and yet I'm not. Can at you all. give me a little of it at least? How does it? I mean... <laughs> No, you're gonna have to watch the oh, show. God. This is this is this is a perfect plug for the show. Really? Yeah. Gotta tune in and see that. Now I'm also told, maybe you can do a little of this. That you're gonna there's this, a friend sketch. There is a friend sketch. Have well, you, see, yeah, there is a, there is a friend sketch. And have you worked there for several years? Have you been dying to do this parody? <laughs> it's a it's a bizarre parody. I would never have thought to make fun of the show in the way that they're doing it, and it's mostly making fun of me, which really makes me angry. <laughs> I'm playing Matthew Perry in front of him, yeah. Well, actually, this is, uh, you know, it's kind of a parody on that, on me trying to play him. Well, actually, I don't think there's ever been a Friends parody on the show, and um, that was one of the goals of the week, was to pull something together, and I'm now wildly studying Lisa Kudrow tapes, so <laughs> hopefully it will uh, all come together on Saturday. Yeah, Phoebe. I'm going to be lucky enough to play the beautiful Jennifer Aniston. Well, I'm going to have to get a wig. She's got gorgeous hair. I play Courtney Cox. That's a huge, I mean, come on. That's, sure. They're all so beautiful, so I'm honored to play anyone. It's a good show to make fun of because it's like, it is a fashion show every week for any woman that's tuning in. Mm -hmm. And um, it's also like, it's just sort of funny the way it's directed, like the way they're all like, jumping on the couch and, you know, coffee. I'm just like, who's like that? You know, that, that's pretty funny. I know they're doing a Friends takeoff, and he's probably going to play Matt LeBlanc. So I hear, and he does a really good Matt LeBlanc. Yeah, I'll be imitating. Uh, I'll be imitating Joey. Yeah, not for a long time because I don't do a great 
Joey. Sorry, Matt LeBlanc. Sorry, pal. Any of your other uh, cast members plan on showing up? I think they're. Um, I think a few of them are in town, so hopefully they'll they'll come by. Be you great. guys do anything alone? <laughs> no, no, no. We don't. Uh, we don't. I don't think we've ever traveled separately. No. In fact, I have Courtney Cox right here. <laughs> on a personal note, I want to ask you how you're doing personally. I'm so, doing great. Yeah. I'm doing great. Couldn't be better. Yeah. You know, um, it, there's nothing like, you know, just getting to go back to the job that you love doing, getting to do this kind of thing to just uh, make you happy. So I'm doing great.